So, may laptop ka, may desktop ka. Ayos! Okay? So, one, ginagamit mo. All of a sudden, na notice mo, parang bumab. Sobrang bumabagal. You start mo na lahat bumabagal. Di magamit. Halos. Then, nag-research-research ka. Until such time, you come up with the decision. Gusto mo i-reformat. Eh, wala kang installer ng system mo. Let's say, for example, Windows. That's the usual kasi na operating system. Usually kasi ginagamit natin, Windows. Okay? Eh, wala kang installer. Ngayon, paano ka gagawa ng USB installer ng Windows 10 or kahit, operate, kahit anong operating system kung wala kang computer? Papakita ko sa inyo, pero ito lang muna ang mga dapat na meron ka para magawa mo yon. Una, mobile phone na may capability na OTG. Siyempre, kailangan ng OTG cable at USB drive at least at least 8 gig the very least. Okay? Paanong gaganyan? Paanong proseso? Bago ang lahat. Intro muna. On your mobile phone, open up your browser and search for Windows 10 Download. Now, look for this link and then click on it. It will take you to Microsoft web page. And then you need to select the type or the edition that you're going to use. Click on it and then click Windows 10. Don't forget to hit confirm. And then you need to select your language. Click on it and then choose your language. I choose English. And then click confirm. And then it will ask you again what type of uh, ISO you would like to download. Either 32-bit or 64-bit. Once you click on it, automatically it will download the file that you're, you wanted to download. And in this case, it's uh, 4.91 gigabytes, almost 5 gigabytes. So you should have at least an ample space on your mobile phone. We need to download one application. Have it installed to your mobile phone. Go to Play Store and look for ISO to USB. Click on it and have it installed. This is the application that we're going to use. So now we need to connect the uh, OTG adapter to our mobile phone. Just plug it in. Then we connect our USB or the USB drive to the adapter. Automatically, the application will detect it. Click OK. On the first one, this will ask you to choose your USB flash drive. And then the second one, it will ask you to locate where you have downloaded the ISO. Automatically, it will go to the download folder. Just click on the, put a tick on the box and click start. And then it will automatically do its thing. There will be advertisement because this is a free application, so bear with it.
Ayan! So, nakita nyo na. Madali lang, di ba? Dati kasi, naging problema ko yan. Yung nagka-problema ako sa desktop. And wala akong ibang magamit na paano ko i-access or paano ako mag -re reinstall ng system na gamit ko. And, sinashare ko lang sa inyo kung paano gagawin. In case, lalo na ngayon, marami gumagamit ng mga laptop at desktop. And most probably, yung iba, napilitan lang na bumili ang desktop at laptop para sa kanila mga anak sa online learning. Okay? So, kung nagustuhan nyo yung video na to, click nyo yung like, click button. Hindi naman, yung isang button, pwede rin. Kung may mga comments kayo, suggestions kayo, may iba pa kayong paraan na pwede nating uh, gawin. Kung halimbawa, kailangan nyo mag-reformat, maliban din sa ano yung term doon, um, i-re-rest system restore. What if hindi mo na magagawa yung system restore. Yung kailangan mo talaga i-reformat. Kung meron kayo ibang paraan na naiisip, uh, pakishare nyo lang sa comment section natin. And uh, kung hindi pa kayo nakakasubscribe, alam ko marami pang hindi nakakasubscribe, subscribe na lang. Okay? And uh, don't forget to hit the bell icon. And uh, yun lang. Maraming salamat. See you again sa susunod na video.